Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to write a program to know whether the character is vowel or not. Okay, so let's start with that. First, we need to include a library that is studio.h. So we just need to write this include and studio.h. So in this studio.h, all the methods are defined. Uh, to take input from the user and to print the result to the desktop without this you cannot take the input and even you can't show the output to the display okay so it's compulsory to include this library into your program okay so after that we need a method that is main method okay so you need to write like this and within this main method you have to write the code okay so our requirement is first it asks for user for a character to enter so first we need a character variable so for that you need to just write character and variable name can be anything so I am taking the character name is A and after that asking the user to uh, enter the character so I am using this printf and this printf is defined in this library okay so I am writing that uh, please enter character okay and after that when user enters the character we need to store the character into this a variable that is character cat type a variable so for that we need to use this method that is scanf and in this for character we use percent c and just use this comma and after that and of a so Whenever the user enters something, this will be going to store in this a variable. So and is address and this is a variable name. Okay. So after that, let's uh, start this and let's see if it's asked for that uh, or not. Okay. So it's actually the antivirus is running. So there you can see this please enter character and when I enter something so if, for character you just need to enter the one so now it's taking the value now we have to check that it's a uh, vowel or not okay so how to check that if and C sorry the variable is a and it's cat type so we need to check a equals equals as you all know that the vowel are a e i o and q okay so these are the vowels so if this a is equal to is equal to a so we need to write this uh, character into this quotes okay and so we have to check for each of this so for for that we need to use this or symbol okay and in the same way you have to write for e and in the same way you have to write for i And in the same way you write for O and for U. There we go. So now when these matches, what we need to do is we need to print F. We need to show the user that it's a vowel. Okay and in else if it's write something else except this e e i u u then print f it's not a vowel okay or it's a console net that's it and just let's execute it and see the result Okay, so it's actually taking time. Okay, so I'm entering A. It's a bobble showing because while we are entering A, it's satisfy this condition and enters into this and print out this. Okay, so now let's restart it and let me enter something else like Z or something else. Okay, so let me just enter Z. Okay, and enter. It's a consonant. Here you can see this. 
and in the same way if you enter the capital A or capital uh, E so it will not satisfy it will show that it's a consonant for that you also have to add for capital A so in the same way like this and in the same way you have to add for E I O U okay so that's it for the today's video thanks for watching please subscribe my youtube channel and hit the bell icon and for more videos just stay tuned and hit the subscribe button